Welcome to Suru's Planet. I am Surbi. You know what I used to be scared of the most? Bees. So look what we have here. There's a swarm of tropical bees. Yeah, like this, I'm gonna jump into them. Well, don't jump into them. Do you know what they're doing? They are trying to swarm like this so that they can move the new queen to a new home. Well, how can they just go the same way and find it? Well, what they're doing is they're swarming around to tell each other <laughs> where's the next place to go and how to get there. So there's a queen somewhere here. Where? We go, I don't know. We have to find her. So this is a very, very rare sight to see. We're extremely lucky. I have only seen this myself about three or four times. I tell you what, I have a hive box where I put these bees so that I can move them to a better location. In this box, we have all those bees. When the bees have made this box their home, we will then be able to remove this box and move it to another place where the bees can make it their new home. Do you know what pollination is? No. Pollination is when bees will go on the flower and transfer the pollen from flower to flower. When this happens, the flowers will turn into fruits through a process known as pollination and fertilization. So just now we showed you the stingless beehive. Do you want to see a stinging beehive full of honey? This is a bee vacuator. It's a small vacuum cleaner that we have put bottles on. You can open up the cap, suck on the bee. So can you feel the suction at the end? Yes. If you imagine there's a beehive here. Try it, baby. We can suck up all the bees and then we can close the cap. So then once all the bees are inside the bottle, we will then take it and place it into hives like this. Open this, you can see all the bees inside. Why is there water around it? To stop the ants from getting onto this box, we put this inside the water because ants can't swim. Can you wear your special vehicles and catch? The real bee? Absolutely. In fact, just around the You can? I can see yours too. Bees don't like smoke. And they, whenever they sense some smoke, they will start eating their honey because they want to prepare to fly off to a new place. So now they've detected that the smoke is there. They're telling each other and warning each other that there's smoke around. It might be a fire. It's known as the Apis Serana. Isn't she beautiful? Yeah. Okay, is she a female or a male? She's a female. Take your suit off now. <sighs> so hard and thirsty. So this is my office where I look after my bees. Why do people call you the bee whisperer? Because I will go close to their ears and whisper things and they won't sting me anymore. That's why people call me the bee whisperer. So, are you still afraid of bees now? No. Good. Now, I'm not scared of bees anymore. I love bees, honey. Bzz.